Hello everybody and welcome back to Mr. P channel. This is another video when I'm trying Linux on DeX. Uh, this is Linux on DeX and as you can see uh, I am in a DeX station. All well, all good. Running Linux on DeX jumps into a Ubuntu flavor Linux distro. In this video I'm going to try to install and see if it runs uh, the application called Blender. Blender is 3D manipulation. 3D, manip 3D manipulation and creation tool, etc. etc. I think it's been designed well, um, invented, let's say, invented, designed, coded by Pixar. So, if you watch any Pixar movies, you know what I'm talking about, what this blender can do. Um, so, if I go to uh, the software center, so basically it's like a synaptic package manager and etc right i tried to install blender using a command line i just went and searched online uh, how to install blender during a command line and it's not very good i mean it's installed something but i couldn't run blender at all so i decided to use this uh this uh software center as a calling synaptic package management managers Blender. So let's search for Blender in this. And bingo, we have a results. We have results. Uh, I hope you'll be able to see. Let me see if I can somehow. Okay, preference the to toolbar, set internal options. Oh no. Preferences, bingo. Color, font. Font, font. Use a custom font. Can I? Yes. Let's do 20. Actually, that's going to change. Bingo. Obviously, it looks hideous, but at least you can see. So, Blender. And first one, it says, a very fast and versatile 3D modeler and renderer. That's the one. So, I, I need to click on that. And it's going to need to say, mark for installation. And it's going to say, tell me. Again, I think I overkilled on the font size. But anyway, it tells me... Uh, if you want to install this, you need to install blah, 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 all these. Fine. Let's mark everything to be installed. So you marked everything to basically install. So we have this selected, we have this selected. Pretty much everything which is selected in green and with a tick, it's going to be installed. That's all you need to do now is click apply. And it's going to tell you 206 megabytes extra space will be used. 500 free sorry 53 will be downloaded and etc download package files only i don't really know what that option do i just i don't really like something like on linux it says something all oh, right packages will be installed right okay because i don't like to click something in linux where it says do you want this only i just i rather set everything to install if I do something wrong with my Linux on DeX, I'm so easy to do. Go back, run this while you're not in Linux on DeX, delete the container, reapply the new one, because uh, I have the backup of my, um, this is the image file that I'm using to install Linux on DeX. If I make a, a boo-boo, if I go to download, this is again the both images that I need to use or I can use in the future if I'm gonna mess it up. I mean like, reinstalling Linux on DeX on my Note 9 takes me about between around five minutes around five minutes so I did something wrong I delete and uh, unzip the file move the image file where I want but bang 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 done that's it five minutes so we, okay let's go back to blender so okay uh, click apply show so right now it's showing what is the loading and etc Let's make it a bit bigger. So this is the loaded to 25 kilobytes from ports.ubuntu.com forward slash Ubuntu ports Xen Universe ARM 64. So let's wait until it's done loading. Okay. Is it actually doing anything? Because at the moment it feels like it's just stopped. Okay, let's give a second or so. Oh, right. Now we're talking. It's downloading all this. Okay. Keep going, brother. Right. Okay. It's installing everything. Installing loads of libraries and whatnot. An actual blender. 18.6 megabytes. 
that's good okay automatic close after the change has been successfully so i'm just gonna click this and basically what the why i click this as soon as this window disappears it means all done so let's see as soon as and obviously for click details very small font size terminal just showing exactly what's happening so leave it running and as soon as the thin window disappears i can actually go oh sorry I try to minimize the, the background and leave this one running in the foreground. But anyway, I got Blender installed. I go to Applications, uh, Graphics, and here's the Blender. So let's open up and see if it runs. Okay, it's actually running. Bingo. Um, <laughs> what next? Uh, I never used the blender before. I mean, all this looks like a, uh, I don't know, like a Star Wars fighter cockpit control dashboard. I mean, I have no clue what all this does. And basically, um, when I received one of you, dear viewers, uh, a suggestion to try blender, I watched a couple of YouTube videos, basically simple blender tutorials and i know couple of shortcut keys or i remember since i watched these videos couple of shortcut keys so i know g this allows me to move the box ever, anywhere if i click y it's gonna go against y axis x is gonna go against x axis and z is gonna go against z axis if i click escape it goes back where it is if i click tab i go to this what they calling it um editing mode you go then object mode editing mode there is then I can uh, node somewhere there is a nodes I can't remember how to get to node editing option I mean it's so much stuff but I got this one here um, so can I actually change the uh, shading post-processing dimensions oh my goodness by here I can do add the modifiers that's the one I remember from the videos I was watching um, curve can I no okay uh, da, 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 da. multiplication what's this supposed to mean I uh, okay what is it I mean, I feel I've done something. This is the, the the light source. So this this is basically the light source. This is the camera. Okay. Uh, well, I, it runs. It's working. It's open. It's running. Um, what I'll do? I'll try. Well, I'll try to watch more tutorials online, and I'll try to create something on this one. And obviously, I'll do an updated video where I'm gonna create something using this and then render basically everything on Linux Dex station on the Linux on Dex so uh, the, the actual software is working and actually it is 2.76 so version 2.76 I don't know it's up to date not up to date blender render yes the guy in the YouTube said you need to use a cycles render because Blender render is obsolete. I mean, it's still active, but I mean, it's no more developed. So all the bugs will be forever. Uh, this is the layers. If I remember correctly from video of layers, the sidebar can be basically done this way. If you drag this one, it makes the dual. And if I click here, is it a, no, view. View node node node. There was a node settings where you can connect the different nodes and then it makes all this happen. <sighs> Seriously, uh, I need to watch a bit more of these videos because I have no clue. And by the way, to remove it, you need to collapse on top and this removes the multi window. If I click this and drag to another side, it does this. If I drag down, that's all you learned from. Uh, 
prodigious. So seven, I think, is numpad seven is just look through. Uh, I can't remember. Anyway, as long as it's working, it's fine. I don't want to hold you any longer. What I'll do uh, in the future, uh, I'll watch a bit more of these tutorial videos. Hopefully, I will learn something new and something that I will actually remember. And um, I'll do a video too and about how this actually blender work in our linux on dex at the moment you saw i can you can install this using a software center or as they calling it synoptic package management and while i am yapping i would like to actually change that back because oh my god it is it is very bad to <laughs> to look at um so install here you you find you search for blender install the blender run it it's automatic goes to online finds whatever it needs, downloads, installs everything. Because I tried manually do over terminal and it was getting some errors or something. So possibly I was typing something incorrectly. So here we are. Blender is running on Linux on Dex. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave them in the comment section below. I'll come back to you as soon as I can. And I'll see you in another video where I'm testing Android apps and games on various devices. And obviously Linux on Dex at the moment. Thank you and goodbye.